I just came in off of uh, the Hello uh, Freestyle, and this guy made it a, a, a pothead anthem. Wiz Khalifa, man. What do you think about that? You got Adele's record to be like a pothead classic. Man. That's what I do. What the fuck? Did she hear that fucking version? What, did she call you on that? No. Nah. You think she's happy that you did it and it's a classic? She should be. <laughs> Will you be performing that on 420 at one of your major pothead events? Buy tickets. <laughs> <laughs> You're looking uh, very exclusive today. I love that jacket, man. <laughs> I thought I, I thought I was ill with my fucking uh, Playboy shit, but this shit is really killing me right now, man. <laughs> I think you do this shit on purpose, man. I wish people could see this jacket. Is, is, is that a Super Bowl jacket? Is that what's going on here, man? Like you know, I, you gotta stay cozy. Uh, I, I see you getting all warm and snug. You got me warm right now, man. What? <laughs> nah, let me pause. <laughs> Yo, were you furious that uh, D- uh, Denver uh, eliminated uh, you know Pittsburgh, man? Yeah. What, how, what was your reaction, man? I know you were you were at the games. You supported it. You were going crazy. Yeah, I was pissed. I see your mother was like, fuck out of here. Like, everybody's like, pissed off. <laughs> you know, I'll, be, I'll be on your mother's Instagram. She'll be cursing everybody. <laughs> <out of here. laughs> well, yo, because uh, I, I mean, you, you stuck around to the end, man. <laughs> what was the result, man? Everybody's angry on that Pittsburgh side, man. Everybody wanted the Steelers to go all the way, man. But what happened, man? What the fuck happened, man? Denver, dog. <laughs> Yo, your mother was like, fuck out of here. You know what I'm saying? What the fuck? You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I know you don't want Denver to take it, man. They took, I mean, Denver got the good weed. Denver got the good weed, but. Oh, uh, shit. Where's the bottom of his fucking mind, man? <laughs> Shout out to your new album. Came out yesterday. And of course, it's everywhere. You can get it on iTunes. A lot of people pre pre ordered it and they're loving it. And uh, the cover was very, uh, I mean, it was very simple. You got your tattoo on it. Yeah, yeah. That tattoo looked like it hurt like a motherfucker. I've been at that. You been at that fucking Khalifa in the back? Yeah. Get the fuck out of here, bro. <laughs> not that I'm not that I'm watching your back, but you always, <laughs> you always be shirtless at all your concerts, man. I don't remember seeing no Khalifa on your back or nothing. Like, I thought you had like a flower or something back there. Like <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like a tulip or something. This nigga is crazy. <laughs> <laughs> so so what, what what's the direction of the new album? Is it still like you know, the, the the Wiz Khalifa spiritual, like, uh, you know, you're bringing us into your world. Uh, what, what is it? What's going on here? Because you, you be high like a motherfucker, man. <laughs> last, time, last time I was with you, I almost went to the hospital, man, that dab shit. Oh, shit. No, it's, it's, uh, it's a little bit of this, a little bit of that. Um, I'm singing on there. I'm rapping on there. Uh, it's definitely a little bit more hood uh, because I'm, I'm rapping Pittsburgh for sure. Oh, okay, okay. But um, it's just by music, by way of music only. I love my city. I love where I'm from. I love my niggas. And uh, that's why I named it Khalifa, because it's about me and what the game has made me. Damn, man. And then uh, did you kidnap the, like all them producers out there that's doing shit? Like, Well, it's a collection. Okay. You know, these are all songs that I've had for a little bit. Yeah. And I, I, you know, King of Everything is not on there. I, nah, thought, I thought it'd be I'm on gonna there. I'm going to put that on Rolling Papers, too. Get out of here. Yeah. That Travis Scott shit is killing it, though. I, That's I right. I it last weekend, man. That's right. I must have played that shit like that five times. Sense, yeah. Shit, man. Mm-hmm. Were, were, were y'all both high? Were y'all in the studio together or you sent it to him? Yeah, we were high as fuck in the studio. The, was he hiding his face in the studio? <laughs> What's wrong with that nigga? Have man? you ever met Travis? I interviewed him. I, I know everything about him, but I, I still don't understand why he, he, he feels the world is like crashing in on him like he, that's why he hides his face you know that right is that what he said he feels like he, he everything in his in his mind is dark like he he don't want to be like life is like happy and cool he goes for the fucked up shit first and try to get happiness from the fucked up shit i'm his happy friend <laughs> <laughs> what did you give him to do that record because he went in on that shit it's a little bit of weed was it kk that's that's one thing <laughs> i did did you? Yeah, no. But he wasn't supposed to put it in a blunt. No. But he did. He put it in a blunt? I let him. You know that's a no-no with your camp. It's my man. Uh, come on, man. You should have just slapped it off his hand or something, man. It's Get the man. fuck out of here, That's man. my man. We needed, we needed him at his best. You know, last week I got a list of fans. Uh, they, they sent a list of all your hits. 
because uh, they heard Yeezy said you had no hits or whatever. TGOD. And they wanted me to read you the hits that they love. You, you want me to read them to you? Uh, sure. Weed and Boys, Work Hard, Tell a Gang, The Statement, You and Your Friends, Remember You, uh-huh. Young, Wild, and Free, Roll Up, Say Yeah, mm-hmm. The Race, mm-hmm. and When I'm Gone. Mm-hmm. And that's only a few. Yep. That's a lot of hits right there. Um, I mean, you know, I don't. I mean, I make my music for people who pay attention to it, and regardless of that rant, because me and homie talked and everything. Of course, was and I'm so fucking happy because I know both sides. I didn't know what to do. I was like, ah, oh, shit, really? But I, you know, I debuted both of y'all records. I was in the beginning of both of y'all careers. Mm-hmm. I saw the nigga flip his car. <laughs> I saw you fucking skinny as fuck, like. Broke, yeah, with fucking currency. I was wearing your clothes. <laughs> I needed your clothes. Yo, the fact that I, yo, I even I didn't have any clothes on the. Road. I know that was up. I needed your clothes. Man. <laughs> I had whack gear too, but anyway, fuck it, man. That's Why'd you get... stop? <laughs> you on, can man. borrow my shit anytime, man. You my brother, man. All right, but I, you know, I'm so. Happy. I got jackets now. It's cool, bro. I'm taking that. Shit. <laughs> when you leave her. I'm taking that but, shit. Um, I'm glad it's over though because uh, I never uh I never like succumbed to the media. Man. I knew it was a communication issue and yeah. I'm assuming you called him first or how, how did it go? You called him? No, I didn't call him. How did how did it happen? Like, you know, we have a lot of mutual friends. Oh, so they put the connections together. Mm-hmm. Because where, where where was it going to go? Like, no, they said thank you. It wasn't going to go anywhere. <laughs> it's to a point where you know the, the, the family the family should be like kind of like cool and collective like yeah. That's best. You know, it went a little too far with the children's stuff, but uh, but I mean, you know, I guess you caught him really bad with the KK thing, it was with weed. that one line. It was weed. I know that. Oh, okay. And I, th- I, I mean, I would never go out of my way to disrespect anybody. Of course, man. Mm-hmm. But I'm not mm-hmm. even gonna play to the media, and I'm just happy that it's over. I like you. You know, it doesn't make any sense. <laughs> you, you're, you're part of the weed culture. Like people who are in weed culture don't search for violence. Like. All you want to do is make money, take care of your family, and keep it moving. Yeah, not even violence, but I, m- I make music for a certain yeah, crowd, like crowd of people, so I would never want to step out of that realm of um, of people that I'm here to entertain. And, you know, the Taylors, they, they've they been there, and they're going to be there. Yeah, they're not going anywhere. Yeah. Like, come on, man. Like, you That's like why a- I love them. You, didn't you hit like a billion views or something like that? Uh-huh. Who the fuck does that? Any video that I drop, <laughs> that's what's crazy. Um, I was drop, I dropped like a few videos that me and Dan did this summer. Mm. Um, like most of us, um, time goes by. I don't even remember. I say so, say so. Permission, no permission. Uh, lit. Those shits got twenty million views. Twenty million. <laughs> do, do, do you twenty <laughs> million? Holy shit, man. So I don't, like, really care about who necessarily buys the shit Mm -hmm. and listens to it on their whatever iPod or whatever. 20 million people heard and watched that video. Like, I can count. (laughs) Just on that one website. That nigga God saw your shit, man. You know what I mean? God was like, yo, go in, man. Like, I'm telling you, man. You don't even have to worry anymore. Like, Right. That is, that's that's an accomplishment. <clears throat> I love that. I'm so happy with that. And that's who I make my music for, the people who, who are running towards that. And they need that every day or they need that every week or they need that every. And sometimes I kind of, I don't always get as much content as I want out there because I be mm. focused on other shit doing other things but as long as I can get to those 20 million motherfuckers who go and click on that video them is my niggas that's Taylor's that's TGOD there's one motherfucker that we need to hone in on and I, I have a specialist that'll go to Brazil kill this nigga I, you, somebody got your Rolex over there no huh you don't want me to send somebody over there to nobody took my watch oh, okay that's, that's not real <laughs> No, that's fake, though. Yeah. Get the I'm about to send niggas out there for you, yo. Come on, man. <laughs> you think that somebody is really going to take from me? A $100,000 Rolex? Yeah. <laughs> Just because niggas. you know my spirit, dog. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, man, I could put a, bro, that's not what people want from me. Mm. You know? 
So that's not true. And you know, I've I've never seen you angry out of all these years. Nah. And your friends tell me you go crazy. And you what? Be, what? Will be like you be smacking the shit out of him and all that shit. Man. What? I smack Will. <laughs> no, I did smack Will. <laughs> but it was because we went to jail and he was tripping. Oh, get the <laughs> And I had to smack him and tell him he was going to be all right. <laughs> Let's get out of Will before he smacked me. Uh, Todd, <laughs> Todd Dollar Sign, man. I see you got him on your album. Your, your, and, of course, uh, Juicy J. You didn't concentrate on kidnapping all the Lil Waynes and all the other uh, the, the usual suspects you usually be having. Right. Why, why is that? You I got, fuck with Wayne. Yeah, I know that. But this album, you kept it like family kind of. Yeah. It's important to put TGOD on. Mm. Mm-hmm. So you kept it like really just that's Taylor it. Gang. Jesus Christ, man! And the, your man Todd Dollar is killing it, man. How many songs he got out now? Like five hundred. Well, he had Blase, was yeah, Blase, and now he got Don't Say it, and Free TC the album. Shit. Um, Fucking a man. He's producing. He's he's writing songs with, um, you know, Selena Gomez and and Kanye and and Ray Shremin and how do you how do you cross and, over into that? Because you've you've mastered it. You could do any record you want. You could do pop. Mm -hmm. You could do country. It's the weed. You think so? You think the weed is the most universal way of linking up with all these celebrities? It's the pot. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> so if I smoke some good I'd be lying if I didn't say it. Because if I wouldn't smoke weed, I wouldn't be down to work with none of these motherfuckers. Get the fuck out of here. <laughs> you, you smoke a little pot, you'd be like, hey, let's do it. Look at your man, uh, Chris Webby, man. He's smoking weed and he fucks Helly Berry because Helly Berry smokes weed. Chris Webby? Thank you. No, see, you talking about rumors. I don't know if that's I don't know real. if that's real, but uh, I heard weed is the reason don't they fuck. Don't done you know. I'm a fucker. I got Halle Berry smokes weed? Tons of weed. Out of here. Well, between me and you, she needs to holler at me, <laughs> at me because I got this little thing. It's see called, ya. It's called KK, <laughs> and it's really, really good. <laughs> and Halle, if... <laughs> When am I gonna see an M&M? M&M, come Let's on, man. Leave a, we were just talking about this today. Yeah, what's up with that, man? Like, when am I ever gonna see that shit? You, are you tired of that stupid question? Or nah. what is it, politics? Or you nah, just nah, I love busy? Him. Yeah, what's up? What, what's the deal, man? I just, I don't be reaching. That's the, that's it. I never reach out. Can I, can I try to do that? Can I set that up? Sure. You know, can I, well, what do I gotta do? I gotta call Will and do the politics and all this stuff. Or? How much about Will is politics? <laughs> <laughs> that nigga, <laughs> come on, man. <laughs> I give up, man. I really do. I fucking give up, man. <laughs> well, let's move along, man. We're gonna get the, we're gonna get the Eminem record done. What, well, what would be the title of an Eminem song that you would want done? If if, if you had a title, you uh, and M. It would have to be. Surprisingly, about getting high. Mm. <laughs> so you have to reenact. You have to bring that shit back with him because you know he doesn't really get high anymore. No, I think he would be able to zone out like what what he would do with a Snoop Dogg record. Mm. You know, that's what that's what I want to do. You know, speaking of Snoop Dogg, I'm glad you brought that up. I'm surprised he wasn't on his album, man. Uh, you got so many Snoop Dogg songs. He's saving them yeah. for the next one. You got yeah. two coming out this year, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. We doing Mac and Devin too. Shout out to Snoop, man. That's my big brother. That's my nigga. And um, are you guys gonna grow old together, like in wheelchairs and all that shit? Like, <laughs> I think I gotta. He just together. gives me so much game. He got his his compound set up. And, yeah. And like he just showed me so many. Oh, you been there in his studio and yeah, all that shit. Yeah. Man, he just keeps showing me so many more amazing things. As a friend, you know, I looked at him as a fan before, and now as a homie, I know him, and I'm like, damn, this nigga's amazing. It, it's it's like there's so much to learn. He it, is fucking amazing. <laughs> <laughs> DJ too. You're you're a DJ, right? Yo, I came daddy? up after him, Daddy Cat. Yo, where'd you get that name from? Why are you calling yourself Daddy Cat? What the fuck is going on? I want. I literally wanted every bitch in the world to call me Daddy. <laughs> <laughs> daddy Cat though. Yeah, nah, it's just a smooth name. It's fun. It's, it's playful. I, you know, who kid sounds stupid, but Daddy Cat sounds weird. Who kid is tight? Is it? I don't know. It sounds like dumb. Stupid who kid? Shit. What is who kid? Like, who is that kid? Like, who? Because I used to rob everybody's albums like 20 years ago. Mm -hmm. So they wondered who the kid, who was this kid that's exactly. told Exactly. So who Nas, that kid? Jay Z, everybody who be looking kid? for me. Oh, who kid? I'm just, thank God, it happens that's to the, your shit. That's the who kid. 
Yeah, whatever. Shout out to a very touching Vin Diesel. <laughs> I actually teared when I saw Vin Diesel tearing. I think he was singing one of your records. Yeah. Did you see that? Did uh-huh. you Did you feel like connected when he sung? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get the fuck out of here. Nah, that's my man. You teared with him? Like, nah, I don't do that. Like, <laughs> <laughs> what, what he sung, See You Again? Yeah, yeah. Damn. Like, Vin Diesel sung it, like, word for word? Mm-hmm. What? Yeah. You ever met Vin Diesel? Yeah, of course. I DJed his birthday party. He cool. He's cool as fuck. That's the homie. He be having bad women at his clubs, though. Like I don't know about all that. <laughs> yeah, that's the homie. That's yeah, the homie. Yeah, I bet you know. Yeah, that's my that. nigga. That's my dog. <laughs> that's, my, that's my round. <laughs> oh, my God. So what are the Steelers doing? Now? I heard you know what they're doing. What are the Steelers doing? It's the Super Bowl. What, what the fuck are they doing, man? They chilling. You chilling right now? Yeah, I talked to Coach. Did you do a party for them for losing? Or, like, did you, like... What, what the fuck is that supposed to mean? There's a loser party. There's always a loser party. Stop that. Are you kidding me? What? I'm doing a, uh, 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 all right, what's the name lost? Uh, New England Patriots. They're doing a big boat ride of, uh, uh, what is it? Uh, That's because it's the Patriots. The crews are doing a big They're cruise. cocky. <laughs> <laughs> what? I DJ one of their parties. <laughs> I know how them fools roll. They be walling the fuck they out, cool, right? They cool, though. They, sh- they legit. So you got somebody the Steelers just laying low, they're chilling, they just... Coach don't play that. <laughs> For real? Yeah. Nah, get out of here. Coach ain't playing that. How is it to, be, to, to stand on that 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 tarmac, man? You went out there, you went on the yeah. grass, right. you were out there. Like, how did that feel? Like, yeah, it's good. Jesus. It's good to be the same height as everybody. But does it feel good you're more popular than the mayor and everybody out there? Um, well, in Pittsburgh, it's like a collaborative effort. Okay. So niggas like Big Ben... And like the mayor go to the same spot to eat. What? Yeah. So every everywhere I would go, because last time I was there, I think your mom came out to check out a Walker concert. Why but... you keep talking about my mom, man? I ain't trying, I mean, hollering at your mom. Oh, like, all she's right. a cool chick. Like, you know what I'm saying? She's just young at heart, right? Yeah. You right. talking about my mom, nigga. Shit. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like LeBron James or something. Get out of here, man. Nah, it's cool. Shout out to Peachy. OG Peachy, what up? What up, baby? Yo, can you give me uh oh shit, I got bitches calling me. Nigga, you, you ain't even turn your phone off for the interview. Oh, guess who's calling? Mom. See? Answer it. Yo, mommy. Mm-hmm. I'm talking to Wiz Khalifa. Can I call you back? Hey uh, mama. Okay, you can call me back. Do you have a uh, soup ready for me? Huh? Oh, forget it, Ma, I'll call you back. Mm. Uh, I, I, I'm in Colombia. Me and Wiz Khalifa, we just bought a lot of cocaine. What? No. Huh? Come on, are you are you coming here? Yeah, I'll, I'll call you later, bro. <laughs> 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 Yo, this shit is crazy. Yo, give me a verse off the album, man. That was one, hard. See, one, that was the best part of this interview. For real? <laughs> Yo, I do that shit all the time. Damn, man. She, she really thinks I'm playing cocaine with friends and stuff. Like, she's weird, man. But uh, uh, give me a verse off the album, man. Like, one cool verse that you really like off of one uh, of these joints. Oh, uh, fuck. I can never think of verses. Um, Come on, man. One, one. Go ahead. Money don't make mm. fuck. Uh, I was like <laughs> one for the money, two for the niggas getting uh. it, three for the niggas that be running from it. You gotta grind if you really want it. Hey. Don't hesitate. You work this hard. You mm, 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 mm. nobody said it would be easy though. Mm, 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 uh, uh. Uh. Nobody understand uh. going up against the odds. Uh, 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 uh. Make your own Hold on Play your own parts You could be your own boss Nobody tell you that All you need is a foundation To stand on uh, hey. And you could build it Then the limit is the sky uh, Until then I'm with my niggas Getting high uh, Stick to the business Y'all know we with it hey. That's not that elevated You definitely are Extremely high When you do these albums huh? Always Like beyond high I don't write shit down <laughs> the fuck out of here yeah. there's no like paper there's nothing nah so there's no proof that's crazy i mean it's better for me because i can feel it like mm. i go off of the cadences that's nuts yeah <laughs>